Well, it's lovely being part of an ensemble because I come from a theatre background and it is a bit like being part of a company, um, a theatre company, because we have the young ones who 10 years ago were starting and then the middle and then the older ones. So um, uh, that is, that is a, a, an environment that I'm very used to working in big companies because I've worked in the theatre in, in big companies. And um, when we get together again, it's lovely because we, when you work with people over a period of time, you have a sort of shorthand. You don't have to introduce yourself or gauge what sort of person they are. You know each other. So life is very much, and, and work is very much quicker because you know how to respond to people. Also, you know your character better, and that gets better as the years go by. And Julian writes for each individual character. He just doesn't write a generic script. It's very precise and everyone has their own point of view and their own life. So it's, it's, a, it's a very interesting thing to do. Over, I've never done anything over that period of time except in the theatre. Anna, who did my, our costumes, um, made some wonderful... It, it's a wonderful period for hats. And um, I do wish we wore hats more because when you see everyone in hats and they're wonderful creations, um, they're great. Uh, to see together and you wonder why people don't wear hats anymore of course we don't have the life where we wear hats and people now wear those little tiny hats with a feather sticking out of them but these are enormously wonderful creations and set at very good angles I mean they knew how to make a hat work we have more time to do an hour and a half's film and um, uh, uh, um, that is the main thing um, so the setups and the what you achieve in a day, of course, it never stops because the the production values are much bigger, because you've got that time. So you can do enormous weddings and you can do um, big dinner parties and you can do balls and you can do things. But all that is a uh, not from the actors, but from the the set designers and the costumes and everything that go into what we actually finally. Uh, wear and um, and we exist in takes an enormous amount of time. I think what I enjoy most is is the story. Sto it's got a strong storyline, and uh, I think it's that's part of its success because it deals with everyday life of these people. So ev an audience enjoy that world. You're taken into the world of of Danton, and. Um, I'm not entirely sure it was, in fact, I know it wasn't as quite as nice in the reality, but the relationships of the people um, are very true, I think, and uh, people have the, their favorite um, characters, so they follow those characters and they follow those storylines. And people, there are, uh, he writes, you know, so many storylines in one episode, and that is, I think, the enduring appeal of this, also the look of the thing. I mean, it looks wonderful. It's wonderful to see it visually. It's it's a it's a marvelous creation. Well, I think it's the, the spectacle. It's it's a wonderful spectacle. Also, it's very humorous, and it I think it will make people very happy to see it. They'll also say hello to the people they know. I think that the experience is one of 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 of. Um, of a carrying on the tradition of, of, of Downton, but with some new faces that they will know, and um, also the storylines which will they'll be amused with. And also we go to France, and there's a whole section when we go to the south of France, or I didn't, but they did. And uh, um, there is some, it, 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 it opens the door to a whole other part of, their lives, yes, I think they will enjoy it immensely.